Alright, what's going on everybody? So today we're going to be taking a look at the Photon Orbital card from the uh, Darkness Gimmick main box. Now, this card is kind of meh. It's kind of interesting. Originally, we were supposed to get um, uh, this card called Hyper Galaxy, which looks honestly looked amazing. Like, the card would have been absolutely... It would have made them brought, like, Photons up a good few tiers. It would have been actually really good. Uh, it was actually originally a card that hasn't even been released in the TCG until like recently, I think the latest set has finally released this card. Um, but Hyper Galaxy was the original card we were gonna get, um, which was um, get rid of monster with 2,000 more attack except Galaxy has Photon. Then target one monster your opponent controls uh, with 2,000 more attack. Tribute it. Then if you do, special summon Galaxy Photon from your hand, deck, or graveyard. Kind of nutty. So it's basically just a plus um, in all all round. Um, obviously your opponent has to control a monster with 2,000 or more attack, but you know, in Duel Links that happens a lot. You're constantly running cards that have high attack stats, so that would have been really good for the game, but instead we got this Photon Orbital card, um, which is okay. It's not terrible. Um, basically, during your main phase one, you could target one Photon or Galaxy monster you control, equip that target, uh, this monster from the card that or field to the target. It gains 500 attack and also it cannot be destroyed by battle. Um, which is kind of, it's, it's nice, it's kind of nice. You can send this equip card to the graveyard to add one Photon or Galaxy monster from a deck trend except Orbital. So basically kind of like, it kind of like searches for, it kind of gets rid of the need for a uh, Photon Lizard um, a little bit. Um, you kind of replace that a bit um because it you can it's you it's kind of does the same thing uh because you except you send it to the graveyard you, you send it to the graveyard when it's equipped to something add one photon galaxy monster from deck hand boom 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 this is just you uh you tribute it then add one level four lower photon so it's kind of doing the same job so you kind of don't really need lizard uh, but you do have photon orbital instead but photon orbital has a little bit of a plus as it's working as an equip effect um unfortunately it doesn't really work <laughs> with Cards like Galaxy Photon. Well, it does work with Photon Dragon, but if you're using Photon Dragon's effect, you're gonna lose the equip card because obviously banish both monsters. Um, so if you banish Photon Dragon, you're gonna banish or you're gonna get sent Photon Orbital, Photon Orbital to the grave. So, mm, you know, it's whatever. You can equip it to like Neo Eyes or you can equip it to uh, or Neo Galaxy Eyes. You can equip it to Star Lord Galaxy One. Uh, we also managed to get, we also finally got Star Lord, uh, Star Lord's Pile and Dynamo as a card in the game now. Uh, rather than just locked behind the mini box or the Selection box, I should say. So now Palin Dynamo is in the game, which is pretty good. Uh, I'll give a quick rundown over the deck, but everything is pretty standard. Uh, we have two Gassy Eyes Photons. We have two Photon Treasures. We have three Advancers. We have three Orbitals. We have three Vanishers. We have three Photon Stream of Destruction. Uh, we have two Forbidden Lances. We have one Galaxy Cyclone. And then we have one Eternal Galaxy for our uh, Neo Galaxy Eyes. Then, then we have the extra Galaxy Neo Galaxy Eyes, Heroic Gemini Excalibur, two uh, Star Lord uh, Leech Galaxy Eyes, uh, one Star Leech uh, Pal Dynamo, or Pal Dynamo, uh, one C39 Utopia Ray, and then one Utopia. Now, no one that actually, you know, they're just kind of extra generic back row support, or not, not back row, but extra deck support. Uh, the main cards we're going to be focusing on will be Pal Dynamo and Galaxy uh, and obviously. Neo, but uh, yeah, so that is honestly pretty much it. I don't have much to say about photons. They haven't changed really much since um, last time. Uh, just the fact that we have a, uh, the fact that we have photon orbital in the game now instead of uh, instead of hyper galaxy, which is originally thought we originally thought what we were gonna get, but uh, we didn't get it in the end. So we have this instead. But yeah, I'm gonna call it there for the intro. We don't need to do say much else. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go ahead and jump in with some duels. So yeah, guys, we're going to jump in with the first duel. So yeah, everything else in the deck is like pretty much standard. There's nothing really, there's only a couple of new cards. One, well, one new card and then one like newish kind of card, which is going to be Palin Dynamo, which has already kind of been in the game. Um, but uh, yeah, so pretty, pretty standard stuff here. Uh, we're going to go first against uh, this guys, or these guys against Blue Eyes. Um, so uh, I'm not a huge fan of going against Blue Eyes, but it's also not terrible. Uh, we do not open up with that, but we do open up with the pretty good hands. We're going to go for... Uh, where, uh, now, where do we actually get to use Photon Orbital? That's another question. Um, but you can... Whether we get to use it or not, who knows. Um, but yeah, we're going to go, go straight for Star Leech Pound Dynamo. And a Pound Dynamo, sorry, we're going to go for Galaxion. Uh, so I'm hoping we can draw Photon Orbital. Um, uh, maybe... And actually, we're also going to use Galaxy Photon because it's literally busted skill. Um, so good. I'm going to turn the man's but I'm going to turn that back to the deck. Um, uh, I think I'm going to, for now, I'm just going to grab a second Photon Stream. I'd rather have two, I think. I think I'd rather have two. Um, as much as I love going for Eternal Galaxy, so I'm trying to go for Neo, but 
I think I'm just gonna do this because I know there's gonna be uh, some heavy cards. There's also gonna be some back row. Uh, so yeah, we got double uh, photon streams and then Neo or or not Neo, but we have our double photon stream and our Galaxy S photon. Uh, so I'm hoping we can draw a photon orbital. Um, it's also just the fact of drawing the card as well. Um, that's also the fact we're gonna go ahead and pop this. Uh, we're going to go ahead and banish you, so you're completely taken out of the play. Um, completely take that card out of the play. That's a card. He's going to set multiple cards as well, I just know it. Um, I'm probably going to go ahead and... Uh, the card. I'm probably going to go ahead and banish, or end, banish this. I'm going to banish it, because it's going to be right geeky, but I'm going to go ahead and... I'm going to grab Photon Orbital. <laughs> Uh, okay, so I guess, I mean, that's just an easy win, right? It's just an easy win. Actually, it's not an easy win because my opponent is carrying Kyroid. Who carries, who uses Kyroid in a blue eyes deck? The hell? Who car Who carries Kyroid in a blue eyes deck? Like, I'm, I'm, that's, you know what? Weird. That's, that's really weird that you're using Kyroid in blue eyes. I've never seen that, but it's the first time for everything, I guess. That means there's going to be more back row, probably. Probably took the Karma Core or something. That's one. Okay, now we're gonna draw photon orbital. <laughs> I just want to draw photon orbital, man. I just want to draw photon orbital. Uh, all right, let's just win then. I think. Well, hopefully, maybe win. Um, yeah. Um, eh, easy win. Uh, rank up batch as well, which is pretty good. Or right, the rank up as well. I guess we could jump in with the second duel here. I guess I'll just keep that as a nice little quick and easy one in there. But uh, yeah, um, I just. I don't know how often we're going to use the card to the duel or to the video because it is obviously going to be um, second blue. <laughs> okay. uh, it is going to be um, harder to draw photo normal. We don't have like a draw pace for it or draw for it. It's not the same guy. This is a different guy. I'm pretty sure. Um, yo, that hand is that kind of nutty. That hand is, his hand's kind of nutty. All right, so let's set both of these. I actually am going to go. Okay. Uh, doesn't matter. I am gonna take uh, Eternal Galaxy this time. I don't think I'll need three photon streams. Yeah, uh, I think that's just being a bit overkill at that point. But um, so yeah. Oh no, I can't take it. Sorry, I'm an idiot. No, I will not take it because I can't take Eternal Galaxy because I realize I don't have <laughs> photon advancer. I'm uh, not advancer. Uh, the other one. Uh, I've forgotten the name of the card. Never mind. Ignore me. Ignore me. Ignore me. Okay, so, I mean, the standard, like, the, the thing with photons is the decks, like, the video, or the duels are very standard, like, there's nothing really out of the ordinary, it's all pretty straightforward, but I think it's cool, definitely, to cover it for blue eyes, cover it for blue eyes, cover it for a video, anyway, but, um, yeah, so we got two photon streams, and we have, yeah, let's see, guys, photon stream, honestly, such is such an amazing card, I'm so glad that it's actually free, <laughs> It was free with kite. Um, I'm, I'm. It's, it surprises me too because I didn't think that they would lock something like that. Not lock something, but they put something like that uh, as a level reward. Um, this card is busted. Like it's a quick play that can target a card and banish it. Like any card and banish it if you control Galaxy Eyes. The only that's the only drawback to it. But uh, you yeah. know, so obviously my opponent's got Ultimate Dragons. Can't do it this turn anyway. Uh, I need to make sure I keep a photon stream for that. Well, I have. Galaxy has this effect anyway. Um, okay, so we're gonna go ahead and banish. We're gonna same same deal again. Same deal again. See, part of me is like I don't really want to go ahead and uh, if this got back or uh, I mean, <laughs> unless like beat on him. Okay, we're good. Never mind. Unless I beat on him now. Unless this my this guy's also carrying. Oh yeah, but Freddy has this. Uh, he's gonna go for a uh, thingy, isn't he? He's gonna go for his, uh, Spirit of White. Everybody goes for Spirit of White, and everybody tries to destroy my back row, and then I end up, yep. Mm -hmm. I hate when this happens. Uh, what's on stream? I mean, I'll, uh, I'll try and bat a shit, but it's not gonna make a difference. It's not going to make a difference. It's just going to tribute it off anyway. Yeah. All right. Listen to bad. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. So we can draw Photon Orbital now. <laughs> maybe. Uh, maybe not. Photon Orbital is really nice though for getting over, over 
Go for three tries of mark on blue eyes as well, which is actually pretty good. All right, photon orbital. There we go. Uh, <laughs> I could put it back in the deck though. Like I really could put it back in the deck. I mean, this thing's gone, and you know, what? I'm just gonna equip it. Since it's for the video, I'm gonna use it. Uh, I'm probably gonna lose that, but that's okay. Uh, and then we'll get rid of this. Drop this thing. Like I have his effect as well. Does that? Uh, see, unfortunately, it'd be kind of cool, actually, that deep eyes. This is deep eyes for some reason. Uh, it's kind of annoying. Kind of amazing deep eyes. Uh, okay. Now we'll get rid of this. Drop the deep, it's okay. Uh, the annoying part is, like, I can't just send both, banish both of the cards, and then... Oh, uh, this card leaves the field. Sort of feels destroyed by a card effect. It's not gonna be destroyed. Um, but... It, the annoying thing is, like... If this, if I banish both cards with Banish Galaxy S Photon and a monster, I don't get to activate the effect of drawing the Photon. I actually have to send the Photon Orbital to the grave. So it kind of, you kind of puts you at a bit of a loss. Where do you think Photon Orbital is actually decent or not? I mean, it's a decent card, and I think it will be the staple in the in this deck going forward unless something changes. Um, but yeah, you have access to eleven star if you're using that. Uh, probably not. I can't be struck by battle anyway, so it's not too bad. Also, I'm going to take a big hit from that anyway. Uh, give me something good. Forbidden Lance is really good. Uh, uh, okay, yeah. I have an idea. I'm going to send... Alright, I'm going to do this. I'm going to send Photo Normal to the grave. And I'm going to add something. Give me... You know what? Just give me anything. It doesn't really matter. And then we're going to go with... Galaxy Photon. Uh, Galaxy Photon. Um, I'm gonna use Photon Stream Destruction. And we're gonna go to the battle phase. We're gonna Photon Stream. We're gonna banish. It's not being struck by card effect. Uh, 15 and 50. Oh shit. And then, uh, do we have to do this? No, wait, I have enough, don't I? What am I doing? What am I doing? You know what? It doesn't matter. I'm gonna win anyway. Okay. <laughs> Second one. I don't think I needed to do that. I don't think I needed to do. I don't even know why I banished the deep eyes. I banished the deep eyes because I wanted to make sure that I had. Um, I ban the reason I banished my the reason for my banishing the deep eyes was just so I had um, just in case there was like other kind of protection or maybe curry bows or anything like that. Just now because I'm surprised by everything because the guy had uh, thingy because the guy had the um, the kite ridden last duel. So I wasn't sure about that. <laughs> I guess we jump in with the uh, third duel here, one third one here. Um, so yeah, I mean, like the deck, I mean, it's it's fun. Like, I genuinely is really fun because I do I do love using Galaxy Eyes. It is a, a fun card. Um, it's a fun card to use. Uh, I just or it's a fun deck to use, I should say. But um, it's always just kind of like it's the, the combos of it are very simple and basic. Um, so it's kind of nothing's really changing with the deck with Galaxy Photon, uh, a Photon Orbital, I should say. But uh, yeah, overall, it's still pretty good uh is this cubics i can't well i can't tell it's not cubic seeds anyway if it's cubic if it is cubics it's not cubic seeds um, um i tell you what i tell you what's gonna happen i'm gonna play it risky i'm actually gonna play it risky and i'm gonna go put you back in that and i'm actually gonna grab eternal galaxy i'm gonna grab eternal galaxy because i want to kind of use it and i think it could be really fun um so yeah, we're gonna go balls to the wall here and play Eternal Galaxy. Um, Cause I think that could be really fun. I love doing that, I love playing Neo. Neo's really fun. Uh, even if it's just a, basically a glorified beat stick at this point. Um, but yeah, it's just a good thing to change your Palm Dynamo, not your Palm Dynamo, your Lord Galaxion into as well. It's a free card to change that into. Uh, I will set the Photon Stream first and then set Galaxy. Uh, even though I don't know why I would bait my Photon Stream cause the card's literally busted as hell but you know <laughs> um okay so let's have a look is it cubics it's not as okay i figured it's not cubics uh aroma gardening is is annoying um but what do i want to banish i feel like I, there's a card i need to banish i kind of should have taken the photon stream now <laughs> i should have taken the other photon stream uh Let's have a look, see, because I feel like one of these is gonna be Dreadwinds and stuff. Is he gonna know? That must be okay, cool. The Angelica. Uh, that's the worst card you could have drawn. I'm so sorry for that one. But I presume one of those is gonna be um, 
One of those is gonna be Jared wins. Uh, one of those is gonna be Jared wins. I should have taken. Uh, p -p 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 I'm gonna banish this. I I need to get rid of this though. I need to get rid of that. Oh, I got Jared wins. Uh, okay. I could really use Fortune Arbola right now. That's not bad either. That's actually not bad either, cause I can use it next turn to get rid of Roma Gardening. I banished. I think this is gonna be Blessed Winds. It's gonna be Human Winds. That's unfortunate, cause that's really annoying. Cause I could. So Majoram, of course. Yada yada yada. Um. Okay. Let's end our turn. I think that's a good idea. End of turn. Um. Hmm. You can tribute it off though. Yeah, that's true. I don't know why I didn't just attack it. Why didn't I? I should have just attacked into Angelica. Uh, you guys national this card from Magic when leave the field. Oh, you're so trash. Yeah. Oh my God, that's so nice. Sorry. Read really to be toxic. That's just so annoying. I should have. I should have just. I should have just ran with it. To be honest, I should have just ran with it. And uh, that's fine. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, I got turn glassy. And then special summon Neo. Neo Galaxy Eyes. Galaxy Eyes Photon. Uh, Sierra. I'm gonna guardian. Can I? Okay. Now I no longer want a photon orbital. I want a photon stream of destruction. <laughs> Uh, you take no battle damage as well from involving cards with this. this is so annoying. Uh, photon stream? Hogs. Hogs, hogs, hogs. Uh, photon stream of destruction. I can't, I have to go with Armor Gardening. I can't get rid of that Majoram. I just can't get rid of it. Because if I get rid of it, it's... Yeah. I could banish both of those, but I think I'd rather just get kill Majoram. I'd rather just kill this card. He's not gonna take any battle damage from him anyway, he's gonna gain the other. But I'm gonna drop him at like 4500. <laughs> drop him at like 4500 with Photon. Or oh, Neo Galaxy has Photon anyway. Uh, I'm hoping he doesn't draw another one. I'm gonna be so upset if he does draw another one. I'm gonna be so upset if he actually draws another one. Okay, okay, I think we're good to win then. Photon Orbital for the lols? Photon Orbital for the lols. Sure, why not? Let's give it to Neo. Make him a 5000 beat stick. Make him a 5,000 beat stick just for the same, just to say that we used it. <laughs> Alright, guys, we're jumping with the um, fifth duel. And we're with the fifth one here. Um, I think I could squeeze the fifth one in. I don't know. I don't know, actually, because the other duels are like four minutes, five minutes long. So, uh, the first three, anyways. So, I don't know. Most of my luck is going downhill a bit. I've lost a few duels now. Uh, I lost a few. Um, obviously, you didn't see. But, um, yeah, it's been kind of frustrating. Ooh, we do draw photon orbital though. We're drawing photon orbital, so that's good. That's good. Um, got a forbidden land. We have a forbidden land, so I'm not too worried. Ooh, DDD. I know that's gonna be. That's DDDs. Oh, it's the original Kaiba, so I guess it wouldn't be blue eyes. Um, but overall, not too bad. Not too terrible. Uh, if it is, yeah, I feel like it's it's gotta be witch, right? So it's not like it's pretty good top deck. It's not like witch is gonna be a super duper big problem, especially with the uh, photon trasher and stuff. Um, I could just protect him anyway. It's not too big of a deal. Uh, okay. I can literally just protect whoever he goes for. It's not like it's a huge deal. Uh, should. Probably put that back in the deck. I'm gonna put that back in the deck. Back in the deck. This should be a pretty easy one anyway. I think this should be pretty easy. Uh, I have a feeling it's gotta be witch, but even if it's not, it shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, it's witch. Uh, it's witch. Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. Uh, you should be done now. You should be done here. Galaxy Photon. I'm gonna put Photon Dragon back in the deck. And then I'm gonna go for Galaxy Photon. Yeah, and then we got Photon Orbital as well. So a little free extra attack point boost. Actually, we don't win. I'm gonna let me know that we don't win because the reason we don't win is because I put him in attack position. Uh, so we're not out of the woods yet. Um, which is okay. 
Or I could use Photon Orbital's effect, right? And then grab Photon Advancer. Uh, and then grab Photon Advancer. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Um, because 3500 is not enough to win. And I need to win. This isn't BM. If it's not BM, if I can't win. So, you know. I get still normal summon it. I forgot we used it last time. And then, well, that Photon Advancer. Get the dub. Yep, and he's great. He scoops the hell out of it. <laughs> Alright, that's gonna conclude today's video, guys. That was um that was fun. That was really fun. I'm again like I think Fault and Orbital is a decent card, and I think it will be a better card to use, the better card to find than Fault and Lizard. Fault and Lizard is Lizard isn't a bad card. It's just I think Fault and Fault and Orbital is kinda nice. I think Fault and Orbital has its flaws in the fact that it has to be sent directly to the grave from its effect. If it had been if this card leaves the field because of an effect, um you can add a photon to your thing, so if you could leave the field because of that, or set the graveyard because of an effect, or something like that, and then you could get activated, because you could combo that with stuff like Galaxy has Photon, where you could do the battle phase, use its effect, and then that gets goes to the grave, you get a free monster. Something like that could have been cooler, but you know what? It's whatever. Harper Galaxy would have been better, but that's fine. Um, so yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the vid. If you did, hit that like button. If you enjoyed, hit the subscribe button. Follow me on Twitter, that's down below in the description. And yeah, I'll catch you guys next video. Peace out, guys.